So guys, I am back with another Lords of the Fallen video and today guys, I'm going to showcase to you how you can solve the latest addition to the game of the Pumpkin Patch event. This will reward you this pump skin mask, you'll also fight a secret boss and a few other things. Today I have you covered. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So this pump skin mask is the basically the overall goal of what you will get upon defeating the secret boss is located after you trigger a few things which i'll guide you through in a quick second the mask i'm not gonna lie it's not the best i've seen in the game it looks pretty cool uh, it's, you can't really see it let me just go quickly go into photo mode i mean it's pretty badass i'm not gonna lie It'd probably go with a few other it's a shame doing a complete armor set to it but hey it's just a pumpkin mask for this halloween event but hey Okay, so how you get this, guys, is you have to find five hidden pumpkins within that umbral world and basically soul flay them. Upon you soul flaying them, you then trigger a secret boss event. And today, guys, I'll guide you through everything you need to know and do to solve this. Okay, so first things first, the first one is found via the vestige of Hanalor. This is real, real early game. So come here, guys, follow what I go, do what I do, soul flay this pumpkin head. And you are done here. Next up guys, we have a pumpkin head found via the Skyrest Vestige, the main area for your player. So come from here guys, go where I go, do what I do, and soul flay this pumpkin head, and you are good. Next up guys, you want to come to the bow room area, the vestige of blind Agatha and follow the path I take on screen. Now, it is a bit of a trek, there will be a few enemies in your way that you will have to avoid or just take down, but do as I do guys and you should get this done.
Next up guys, we need to come to the vestige of Valade. So come here guys, follow the path I take and do as I do and you are good. What I will say is, this won't be the last time we come to this vestige within this guide. Next up guys, you need to come to the vestige of Loche, I believe that's pronounced. So come here and follow the path I take and do as I do and grab this thing. Okay, so now guys, we need to clear out a boss who is in our way and plus it's said that his remembrance armor is needed for the secret boss to spawn in. What I will say is this definitely wasn't a requirement for me, but the few people I've seen who can't get this secret boss to spawn in have had to wear the Hush Saint boss armor. But if you've already taken out the Hush Saint boss, go to Skyrest and purchase his armor set using the remembrance. It consists of three parts i think it's chest arms and legs if you haven't taken out the hush saint boss yet follow the path i take on screen now to him again guys this is from the vestige of Valade. so follow the path i take on screen now and get this done Now what I will say is you want to activate this anchor between realms just before this boss fight. Just in case when you take the boss fight out, you do have to wear that Hush Saints Remembrance armor. So you have to go back to Skyrest to purchase it. And this anchor just means you don't have to run all the way back here from the Vestige of Valade. So yes, definitely activate this. So if you had to take out the boss, make sure you grab his Remembrance. Now within this Hush Saint boss area, this is where the new secret boss spawns in. His name is the Spirit of the Bleak Season. And where you find him is, you want to look for like a wooden structure, like a small wooden structured area. 
when you find it guys you want to enter it now in the center of this there will be another pumpkin for you to soul flay so make sure you're in that umbral realm now if the boss doesn't spawn in this means you will have to wear that hushed saint armor set so you want to head back to sky rest and purchase it using the remembrance again for me this definitely wasn't a requirement i've tried this numerous times i went into this boss fight completely naked i went in it with my angel of the void armor and the boss always spawned in for me but again for you guys if the boss isn't spawning in make sure you go back to sky rest and purchase that hushed saint armor set using the remembrance and then guys come back here using the anchor between realms that seedling and then fight this boss now what i will say is it disables your health regen using your potion so if you got any of their burst stones make sure you have them on but again the boss is quite easy to take out i'm not gonna lie but do what you gotta do now once you take him out guys you are rewarded a few things but you also get this pumpkin mask and it really is as simple as that guys and that is the pumpkin patch event how you solve it and the rewards from it guys if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i will see you on that next one